God. I'm gonna put this frame thing down. My name is Dean Lim. I play in a band called Arch Spire and uh, we are from Vancouver, BC, Canada. Now recently we put out an album late last year called Bleed the Future and we submitted that for what's known as a Juno Award here in Canada. What that is, it's basically your Canadian uh, Grammy equivalent. In 2017 we were nominated. We had a very fun time at the Vancouver Awards Ceremony. I got to see uh, lots of cool stuff, eat tons of free food. It was a great weekend. We didn't win but we were just so happy to be nominated and hang out and we had a great time. Now we didn't really have much expectation because this year in the same category, which is the heavy rock, heavy metal, I don't remember, best hard album, I think it is. There were some amazing, insane bands that we were up against. So a band called Spirit Box, a band called Brand of Sacrifice. I mean, there was like some real stiff competition. We didn't really think we were gonna win. So we had a US a full North American tour planned. We were on the last few days. We decided to brand our last show, which is in Vancouver, as a Juno Award losing ceremony because we were so sure that we were gonna lose and we won. The award takes a couple months to send out. Guess what just showed up just today? So I'm gonna unbox it and uh, check it out. I know that our vocalist, Oliver, he's already gotten his and he said the box is really cool and I'm very excited. I've never unboxed anything like this before. Of course, it's crazy that a death metal band won this. We're gonna check it out and uh, hope you enjoy it. All right, so it comes in a pretty big box. Uh, on the shipping label, it said, brand new shiny Juno Award, which is really strange. Usually they wouldn't describe with so many adjectives what is inside of the box. When you win one of these, you basically get rid of all this shit. You have to go through and uh, say who is in the band and everybody gets like a free statuette, like a free trophy. Uh, and you can order extra ones for I think 550 Canadian dollars, which is about $10 US. All right, here is, the, holy shit, that's heavy. This is the box, it has some sort of black uh, thing on it. I don't know, some sort of piece of paper. I'm going to take it out of this. And it says Juno's on there. Um, very, very cool. I don't really quite know exactly what it looks like. I think I've seen some small pictures, but yeah, my plan is to put it up here on my shelf. I don't really have, have a lot of room. I might have to put it somewhere else. Not that I have a lot of other trophies, it's just all other bullshit. So this will have to go somewhere uh, pretty special. All right, a very nice soft interior here. And we have a shimmy or chamois, whatever that's called, some sort of cloth. There's Oh, a little card. We're gonna check that out first. Society Awards, oh, it's not a card, it's, oh, this is an advertisement for Society Awards. This is, must be the, the company that makes it. Society Awards is the premier designer and manufacturer of limited edition awards and luxury gifts. Recognize the world over for its finest craftsmanship seen at the world's most prestigious events. Treat your Society Awards original as you might a fine piece of art. Okay, pretty weird. I play in a death metal band and I'm, Getting all that. That's very strange. Oh, holy shit. This is fucking heavy. I'm gonna get fingerprints all over this immediately. All right. This is fucking sweet. I don't think this shelf would even fit it. Uh, this is the, the award. It's covered in fingerprints now. Uh, hopefully you can see this here. On the side, it says, Bleed the Future, Archspire, Metal slash Hard Music Album of the Year 2022, even though it came out in 2021. Oh my God. Wow. Well, that's very, very cool. I'm very excited to have won this award. The bands that we were up against is, I mean, it was just stupid. We just really didn't think we were gonna win. And, uh, and somehow we uh, managed to convince people that we should, but, just being nominated is cool because you get all the press and the promo and the billboards up in Canada. Yeah, I mean, it's just a whole uh, experience. I'm very excited and glad to be a part of it. Uh, even if we hadn't have won, I still would have been just as happy. So this is cool. Uh, and thank you so much for watching. I've never unboxed anything like this before in my life. It has a little head just like me, a little bald head. And that's all I have to say about this. Hopefully I don't break it. I feel like I'm gonna break it. Not that it feels like a poor craftsmanship. I just feel like I'm gonna pick it up the wrong way. It feels like it's like 15 pounds. Like it is really heavy. The Juno Awards were originated by Walt Grealis and Stan Cleese. Okay, don't know who those guys are. Thank you so much for watching. I'll see you next time.